people, welcome back to my channel. So it's that time of month again. It's time for another Geek Gear Wizardry unboxing. This is the August box. I was a bit confused as to why the lid was sellotaped, but when I cut the sellotape off, I realized it's because the lid didn't fit on properly. <laughs> so yeah, that's why, little sneak peek there. And yeah, let's get on with it, shall we? Okay, as always, I'm gonna pull out the T-shirt first. There's a lot of writing on this T-shirt. It's black which is fine by me here it is yeah there is a lot of writing oh the weird sisters Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry request the pleasure of your company for your entertainment the weird sisters the annual Yule Ball the annual Yule Ball the Yule Ball's not annual even when it was on it was on every four years wasn't it Anyway, doesn't matter. The Yule Ball, strictly dressed to impress. See Professor McGonagall for more details. I do really like the design and the font of the writing. Uh, I like that there's a little Hogwarts there. There's a Ministry of Magic logo there and a really nice picture of a cauldron. I like the t-shirt, that is a win for me. It's something I would definitely wear probably over Christmas because it's your ball theme. It's not really a Christmas themed t-shirt but if I was to wear it somewhere around Christmas. <laughs> Next up taking up a lot of room is the print. Let's take this out and see what we have today. Ta -da! Oh so this is the Forbidden Forest and that is Aragog, I believe. There are lots of other spiders. There's the Ford Anglia as well. I believe that is the same number plate. Yeah. Um, but yeah, really nice design. I like the paper. It's very soft paper. That's really nice. And yeah, very beautiful paint job. I can never unroll these properly. Stay unrolled, please. I believe that is a H. Simpson in the bottom corner there, which means it's another print from Holly Simpson. Should have guessed, her prints are lovely. I always welcome a Holly Simpson print. Um, but yeah, very scary, very scary print for Halloween, as Halloween is coming up soon. Yeah, I really like that, really nice design, lovely colors, very nicely detailed. Very nice print. It's been a while since we had a wand in a Geek Gear box. I have got quite a collection of them myself. I don't know if you can see them, know that I've moved them to the bottom here. I don't know what to do with them, to be honest, because they're all quite short, because they have to fit in these boxes. So they don't go as big, as long as the some of the Noble Collection ones. So I, I don't really know how to display them, what to do with them at the moment. So if you've got any ideas, let me know down in the comments. Anyway, unique ones. Let's see what we have this time. Oh, looks very pretty. Here we are. That is very nice. Look at that. Very nice. Very beautiful one. Very beautifully detailed. There are some runes or something just here. Very beautiful colours. I believe I see the card here. So the card says this is an azure wand. Azure, azure. Length 13 and a half inches. Core Thestral Tail Hair and Wood Elm. Hmm. I like that. It's really nice. It's gonna be it's definitely got to be one of the better quality wands that Geek Gear have done. Gonna join my wand collection. My Geek Gear wand collection. <laughs> Yes, rain, very pretty one. We have another one of these brown boxes that they put a lot of their, um, I'm just distracted by the pattern, but where they put, what they put a lot of their items in. Does that make sense? Um, and it says eternal glory with a picture of a maze and the Triwizard Cup in the middle. Now I remember one of the hints was to do with the Triwizard Cup or the Triwizard Tournament and I was hoping and praying that there was going to be a mini Triwizard Cup in this box. Maybe this is it. Ask and you shall receive. <laughs> I remember asking for one of these ages ago when they put out a comment on social media, what would you like to see in our boxes? And I said that I would love to see a Triwizard Cup and they've done one, it's so cute. It's very nice quality. It says Try Wizard on it with three dragons and another one at the bottom here. I believe they're dragons. It's very beautiful, very nicely detailed and it def it's definitely going on my Goblet of Fire section. Maybe just pop it right there. Yes. 
Very nice, I like that. Very pretty. Ooh, this box has caught my eye because it's bright blue. And the box is giving it away straight away what's in here. So on one side it says Sneakoscope. On the other side there is a picture of a said Sneakoscope. And there is some writing which is in a completely different language. I'm assuming that this isn't something that Geek Gear made because of the different language on the box. You know, when I, when I saw Sneakoscope, I was kind of thinking, oh, it'd be like a little uh, spinning top, which is what Sneakoscopes are meant to be. But it has this little ball in it, and I suppose you just shake it like that. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I like to be brutally honest on this channel, but yeah, it just, it kind of looks like a child's toy. I know, I, I like the idea, it's very, it's very fun to swirl the ball around. <laughs> Um, I don't know. That's not personally a win for me, but there you go. That's just my opinion. Maybe other people like it. I'm going to put it down now because it's making a lot of noise. It looks as if in this box we have a chess piece. Another chess piece to add to my ever-growing chess piece collection, which is fine by me. So yes, we have this chess piece. I have no idea what it's supposed to be, what the name of the chess piece is, because I don't know chess, I don't play chess, but I'm sure it will say on the items list. Very nice quality, as they always are. I like the, it's doing like a peace sign. <laughs> is, that, well, is that a peace sign? No, that's a peace sign, I don't know. And I'm, I'm tired, I'm sorry, I've been to work today, I'm filming this in the afternoon. So that's why I'm not like my usual like, Woo! South today. I'm, I'm tired. But yeah, nice quality. I will sit it with the rest of my chess pieces. Oh, in my haste to get ready to film this video, I forgot to put my uh, bracelet on. Only just remembered what with opening up the next charm, which is a Hogwarts acceptance letter. So yeah, it actually looks like an acceptance letter. It says, Mr. H. Potter, the cupboard under the stairs. Couldn't fit anything else on it. <laughs> And on the other side, there's a little Hogwarts crest and a stamp. Very nice quality, quite a big charm, actually. Yeah, I'll add it to my charm bracelet. I do wear my charm bracelet out and about on a, when I'm on a day off. But I've been at work today, so that's why I've not got it on. Anyway, nice addition to the charm bracelet. And I believe, I believe that is everything in the box apart from the scratch card. No win, better luck next time, as usual. <laughs> And yeah, that's everything in the box. Let's have a look at the items list. August 2020, we had the exclusive Weird Sisters Tour t-shirt. The Forbidden Forest Community Artist Artwork done by Holly Simpson. Exclusive Sneakoscope replica. Triwizard Cup Port Key Mini replica. Wizard Chess Piece replica. Unique Wands exclusive Azure Wand and the Monthly Charm Collection acceptance letter. Next month's box hint has Harry, Ron and Hermione running towards Hagrid's cabin in Philosopher's Stone. Maybe something to do with Hagrid then? I don't know. But yes, that was the August 2020 Geek Gear Wizardry box. What did you guys think? What's your favorite item in the box? For me, I really like the t-shirt. Actually, it's not every day I say that I like the t-shirt from the boxes, or that it's one of my favorites anyway. I also really like the Holly Simpson print, that is really nice. And the mini Triwizard Cup replica as well. I'd say they were my favourites. But let me know down, down <laughs> But let me know what your favourite was. I am going to go now because I'm tired and I still need to edit this video. I'm going to go. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like if you did. Thank you all very much for watching and I will see you next time.